Hi, I'm Mark Goldblatt, and this is Trailers from Hell, and now I'm very privileged to talk about the 1969 James Bond film on Her Majesty's Secret Service, which is my favorite of all of the James Bond films that have been made. And it's especially a favorite because uh, it was directed by Peter Hunt. It was his initial film as a director, and Peter Hunt was formerly a film editor, which is what I am, and had edited a whole lot of previous Bond films and done it very well. Uh, he really knew the ropes. He knew this series very well. He knew how to work with all of the different units that were shooting simultaneously to let them know the kinds of material that he had to get to make a really terrific picture. I think that uh, Peter Hunt succeeded in making what I believe is one of the most thrilling, exciting, and kinetic action films ever made. And I know that's saying a lot. But I can tell you it's certainly been highly influential in my work as a film editor. And it has something unique in the annals of all Bond films. Great emotion and traces of vulnerability in its protagonist. It's an action epic, but also a terrific love story. After Sean Connery finished filming You Only Live Twice in 1967, he decided to quit the series. Replacing such an iconic presence was a daunting task, and over 100 actors auditioned for the assignment. Lobbying heavily for the role, 28-year-old Australian actor model George Lazenby won the coveted role. Now, public response to his performance was not tremendously positive in 1969, but to be fair, Connery's iconic work was a tough act for anyone to follow. He was ingrained in the public consciousness as the definitive James Bond. In hindsight, Lazenby had a strong commanding presence, and he acquitted himself quite well in the role. And contrary to the belief that this was a box office failure, although it didn't do as well as previous Bonds, it was still a huge international hit, recouping ten times its cost. The production was extremely lucky to cast Diana Rigg, hot off her stint as Emma Peel in The Avengers, as the female lead, Contessa Teresa de Vincenzo, or Tracy. Classically trained and a member of the Royal Shakespeare Company, Rigg is a commanding, free-spirited presence as the wild and passionate daughter of the head of the French Mafia, played by the great Gabrielle Ferzet. Scenes such as Bond's cable car escape from Peas Gloria and the ski chase that follows are really groundbreaking. In this one, Olympic ski champion Willy Bogner was on skis with a variable speed camera strapped to his body, speeding downhill and achieving white knuckle moments that leave you gasping. With state-of-the-art technical contributions like Sid Kane's production design and John Barry's musical score reaching on Her Majesty's Secret Service knocks my socks off every time I watch it.